<laughs> Greg went to Mexico. He I flew did. into Cancun. Yes. And, uh, which I was surprised. As, as surprised as I was that yeah. Menace was staying and not going anywhere. Yeah. Right, Anytime right. Anytime Greg actually purchases a oh ticket my God. and goes somewhere. And goes to a resort. And follows through. Yeah. I know. Whoa. Yeah. It's, it's shocking. And that was an impulse buy. Yeah. Whoa. I remember we had that vacation coming up. Oh, you know what? I'm going to book a trip. Yeah. Yeah. Look at you. So oh, Greg goes on this vacation. And that is the uh, the inspiration for his Tuesday takeover today. Go ahead and explain it to everybody, Greg. Well, it's a simple vacation, true or false, based on what you know about me, because you guys right. probably know me better than most. And mm-hmm. I'm going to read you a statement, and you have to guess simply whether it's true or false. Okay. These are all things that would have happened on your vacation. Correct. Okay. This is one we left, and this is uh, <laughs> all pertaining to our trip to Cancun. So, number one, true or false, we nearly missed our flight because we were busy at the airport bar drinking and chatting. Absolutely true. true. Thousand percent true. Yeah. True. I'm going to say true. false. Wow. Everybody mm. but Woody knows me so well. We almost missed uh. our flight because <laughs> I th- the flight was at 1045 a.m. I thought, oh, that means you could board up to about, what, what 1030-ish. Give or take. Yeah. Yeah. International flight. Yeah. yeah. And I'm drinking yeah. and I'm mm. talking to the bartender who owns some company that does tours in Greece. Next thing you know, I'm like, ah, we should probably head over to the bathroom real quick and then get on the plane. While we're in the bathroom, I hear the call the, the on the intercom. Call. Yeah. Right, we are now boarding and we have two passengers that we're looking for at gate 137. Oh my God, that's us. Cut off <laughs> midstream and run. Last people on the plane. Did you wash your hands? Nothing but dr- I did not. Oh, wow. I mean, I had to run. Yeah. How, how many drugs were you on? <laughs> I took two muscle relaxers. No. <laughs> <laughs> and instead of having three beers, I had two yeah. Bloody Marys. Oh, that's which, healthy. Which leads us to number two. Well, see, let me explain the reason that I said that uh, that was not going to be true. It was because much like how Greg's parents will practice yeah. driving to the airport, there is a part of Greg that is very, you know, uh, particular, buttoned up. Has to know, mm-hmm. you know, oh, yeah. needs a spreadsheet for yeah, everything. Right. I figured he would be more like paranoid because he's talks mm. about like, you know, not being able to sleep because he's paranoid that he might oversleep his right. alarm. So like when it comes to catching a flight, especially In- on a vacation. Incredibly true. Yeah. So yeah. I, that's why I was figuring there's no way. I know he likes to drink before he gets on the plane. Yeah. But there's no way that he's going to almost miss his flight because of it. Right. But, but usually he has caregivers to get him around <laughs> yeah. the airport, True. you see. You make it sound so like, like I'm a 90-year-old w- in a wheelchair. When he's in charge, I'm not surprised that <laughs> yeah. he's like confused about True. when he should be at the gate. Ah, 1045. Uh, you can get on. Take over to Gregory vacation. True or false? Number mm-hmm. two is on the actual flight to Mexico, my fear and anxiety over flying actually led to, quote, medical attention and then some. Hmm. Uh, true or false? This Medical could be true, attention but and then some. Two muscle relaxers and a couple mm. of Bloody Marys. Yeah, I mean, Medical I attention. I'm putting that in quotes. Yeah. But now, what did you, uh, what did you drink on the plane? So you had the two Bloody Marys, <laughs> and I had a beer on the plane. Oh, uh, beer. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to say, say false, false because false. I think Greg yeah. would be mortified to bring it to anybody's attention <laughs> that he would need <laughs> medical yeah. attention. And everybody knows, like, if there's any kind of medical attention yeah. that you get, the first thing you want to do is see your penis. <laughs> yeah. And so that would have also mortified Greg. Uh-huh. Hola, señor. Uh, yeah. You need to see your uh, penis. Wiener? The key me penis. Oh, you, Greg Gordon, let yeah. me see your penis. Uh, get out your yeah. penis. I would say true. Okay. Say, yeah, medical, I can quotes medical attention. Right. He's just right. sweaty yeah. and shaky. I'm going to say false. Yeah, I think false as well. Well, it is true. Yeah. No, oh, what? In the sense that... I took two muscle relaxers, two Bloody Marys, one beer, and yet I felt like I was on a mountain of cocaine. I was so nervous. <laughs> the flight, in my opinion, was so bumpy. And the entire time, as you know, I pick my left thumb constantly. Mm-hmm. I picked it. Here's exhibit A for Ravy to... to I oh, almost took the nail off. You must have really been <clears throat> bleeding. Oh my God. It would not stop bleeding so while it's bleeding i've got my thumb in my mouth i've got my right uh, hand on the handle of the seat and oh. every single bump i'm going oh my god oh my god oh my god and i'm freaking out mario says would you please be quiet and what are you sucking your thumb for i'm like I can't, it won't stop bleeding Ew. so the flight attendant comes over she's like oh we need to get you some gauze she puts gauze on my thumb and then whispers something to mario and i thought oh how sweet she's being so attentive what she was whispering was apparently i had uh, made a few other passengers afraid with my constant, oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, that, that'll happen. Would we please yeah. change seats to the back of the plane? Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. so we had they to sit, moved you? They moved us to the second to last <laughs> row right before the bathroom. 
because of my screaming and all oh that. God. Yeah, that made other people nervous. I was so embarrassed. Mario was so embarrassed. Oh. Right. After all these flights Awful. that you've taken, especially recently, yeah. we've been on a lot of flights. We were just yeah. on a flight. Like, can't you chill now? Like, uh, like I... <laughs> I promise you, yeah. I try. Like, you see, everything's I okay. Yeah. I promise yeah. you, I try. We've been on some pretty bumpy, turbulent I promise flights. You I We've tried. had some pretty rough landings. Yeah. Yeah. But he didn't have his flying buddy menace with him. I know. That's what happened. Do you, do you think mm -hmm. the alcohol and drugs is making it worse somehow? No. I, Probably. It's got to. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I have a problem. I admit it. I will work on it. Number three, we ended up switching rooms not once, not twice, but three times because the rooms did not meet our expectations. True. True, absolutely Three times, true. that sounds a bit much. I'm saying false. I don't, oh, see, I don't see Greg wanting to cause a stink that much. I say maybe, oh yeah. Now you guys are making me rethink it. I'm going to say true. I'm How gonna much did you pay that. for this vacation? Yeah, what kind of cheapo Motel 6? No, he was oh, at, please. <laughs> it was a nice place. He was at a Secrets Resort. Yeah, Ooh. loved it. With the Vine? The right? Vine. Cancun? Secrets, mm. the, vine. Right. the Vine. Give me a ballpark. How much you spent on this va vacation? Four grand. Four <gasps> grand. Well, for both of you, right? Yeah, yeah, for two people. Um, no, right. Now I'm going to say that's it's false. false. See, false. Woody knows me. That's completely false. I was 100% satisfied with my room. We didn't even change it once. Yeah. It was awesome. And if it, it, mm. it oh, even if it wasn't, secrets, he probably wouldn't have said anything. Secrets is the resort that uh, my wife and I go to, a different one called uh -huh. uh, Secrets Maroma Beach. It's in Riviera Maya. Secrets. I want to go to that are, one someday. You should. Uh, it looks Everybody so says, like, good. of all the secrets, that is, people have gone to all the different ones. They're like, yeah. that is the best one. Well, well, secrets of, Marquis and Cabo also rules. Yeah. yeah. Out of all, my, all the places in Mexico, Riviera Maya is my favorite. Yeah. And the uh, the service is unbelievable. And if they if they even get the, the hint that something may not be to your satisfaction, they go so overboard mm -hmm. to make sure that you're happy. So you wouldn't have moved rooms three times. Maybe no once. way. Yeah. No. All right. You know how easily I get embarrassed. Imagine how mortified I was when a hotel maid walked in on us whilst having some daytime hotel sex. True or false? Ooh. Mm. Hmm. I don't see them be, like being that oblivious. False. False. Yeah, false. They would knock first or something. True. I'm saying false. I'm saying true. Okay. Everybody wins but menace. It is completely oh, false. Damn. <laughs> yeah. Completely false. Believe me, lots of hotel sex, and I'm more than sure that the... Do not disturb sign is always hanging from the door. <laughs> yeah. Plus, guys don't make as much noise like that would drown out, you know, knocking. Oh, you don't know me. <laughs> yeah. Wait, really. that resort has actual <laughs> signs that hang on the door. There's not like that red light that you turn on. There was not yeah. a light. It was a red tag. Wow. Yeah, it was a red yeah, tag. Though. Look, Greg, <laughs> Greg was screaming on the plane. You don't think Greg's vocal during sex? Yes, oh, come no. on. He had to move on the plane. Yeah. Yeah. He's yeah. so yeah. Greg, are you yeah. loud? <laughs> uh, no. Are you a talker? Uh, no. I'm a, I swear like a mother effer when I'm Ooh, doing yeah. that. But no, I'm not yeah. loud. I'm not yeah. <laughs> really a talker. Oh, okay. No, yeah. no. How about this one? True or false? I considered climbing over a 15th floor balcony railing just to avoid a bug. True. <laughs> true. Uh, true. True? Yeah, I'll, I'll go true. You are all dead to real <laughs> true. Jeez. And I give you exhibit B. Oh, and I jinxed this, this. I jinxed this. Now, this is the bug that we saw it is a grasshopper. Oh, wow. oh they're huge. Big. They are huge. Yeah. <laughs> and I am responsible for this because in my head, I thought, wow, you know, Cancun really has no bugs. Oh, I was wrong. Oh, they do. Oh, yeah. They, they have got mad bugs. The biggest lobster sized grasshoppers. <laughs> so, this is a picture of a grasshopper that we saw one day. Yeah. The next day, I go out on the patio, unbeknownst to me, not doing a grasshopper check. <laughs> yeah. There was a grasshopper on the glass railing oh, when I was out there. Oh no! When I saw it, I ran to the back of the balcony, Ooh. up against the wall. Just as those, you know, those birds in Cancun—they look really evil. A bird came, grabbed it, started eating it. So I considered going nice. around this That's balcony cool. thing. And now here is Exhibit C: the dead grasshopper's oh, head wow. on okay. the patio. Oh, wow. Look at that! Oh, wow. oh my God! Nice. It yeah. was the worst. And I was on the 15th floor, and I considered shimmying around this railing. <laughs> now, uh, I see these every time we're in Mexico. They kind of look um, like they, they're not raccoons. They're kind of like a cross between like a monkey and a raccoon. Yeah. They have these really long tails. Really? Okay. Yeah. Like yeah. a lemur? They're like and they wild. Have, like really they're long, like, pointy they're noses. They're like spider monkeys almost. They're not monkeys. They're not climbing on. Uh, they're, they're just kind of roaming around the grounds. or They're trying to yeah. dig stuff out of the grass to eat and... And they travel um, in packs and yeah, stuff. Yeah, they don't. They don't bother I haven't you. Seen yeah, that. they don't bother uh, you. I, oh, Cotamundi. 
Oh, Coda Mundi. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that would be yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yes. That was the Coda Mundi. Yeah, but yeah, they're just walking all over the resorts. Yeah, and I did see some of those giant grasshoppers. Oh, my God. They're huge. Bob's in the water. You know, they have those like the ropes up for designated swimming areas, whatever. So one of the buoy things that was, and they just perched right on top there. I'm like, oh, wow, that thing is huge. Did you splash it and? Make it drown? No, I went right up to it, and I <laughs> oh, and it crawled it. it crawled up onto my hand. Oh, babe. oh, and I was and I was and I was just like <gasps> turning my hand and like looking at examining yeah. him. Oh my and god! Then, and then I let him go back onto the uh, to the buoy thing. I would have slapped it down <laughs> onto the water. Not bite you, Greg? No. <laughs> I know they're not yeah. going to bite you, what, you. Like their faces, like on the ones that are that big, you can really see the detail of their face. It looks like a dude in a gas mask. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's like Bane. <laughs> really, it does. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's and, crazy. And FYI, bird, uh, that bird is a grackle. Yeah, a grackle. Uh, like they angry, look and evil. Very angry, yeah. like smaller. Very uh, angry looking. Your and hotel was, room didn't have a machine gun to shoot these things. Uh, <laughs> I wish I, it I had. was. Uh, and I was also really impressed by the uh, the skill of the seagulls that I saw mm. on the beach. They would like fly, uh, you know, over the, over the water, and then like straight up nose dive. Yeah. Into the water right and come out with a fish. Oh yeah. Like that's awesome. It's a buffet. From nature. It was so yeah. cool. So cool. All right, this Mad is a Tuesday fish. takeover. Greg is sharing some uh, true or false vacation stories. Has, Let's get one more before we go to the break. One more. I almost opened my big fat mouth after witnessing something before the flight home, but luckily I didn't say anything because if I had, it would have looked bad, not just for me, but for everybody in this room. True. Oh, interesting. Hmm. Open my big fat mouth. Big. Yeah. True. Yeah. I'll say true. 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 Oh, it's just like, a, do you know who I am sort of thing? No. 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 This is Greg overreacting to something. Well, yeah. here's the deal. It is true. And when we were in line in security to check our bags to go on the flight home, I don't know if that you had the same experience, but in Cancun, the airport there, it takes an eternity uh, to get in line and check your bag for the flight home. It does. Mm -hmm. It takes so long. Oh. We were. I guess when you're not flying first. Yeah. Uh, getting. It's getting. <laughs> 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 we were the third people away from being able to check our bags, and this family walks up, mom and dad in a wheelchair, two, uh, let's say, 20-ish daughters and a guy. I don't know if that was the husband or their son. Because the parents were in wheelchairs, they got to cut into line, check their bags, but while they're checking their bags, they had to reopen their bags, shuffle everything from oh, one suitcase weight? to the other. Yeah. They had problems with the their worst. paperwork. It Ugh. took literally 30 minutes. When they walked wow. away, everybody in line, this ruled everybody in line Woo! they were cheering because they were finally done as a way to humiliate this family Good. right I, I prefer, I prefer proof. so yeah. we go to the gate this family happens to be on our flight and oh look at that mom and dad they walk just fine yeah. here's the mom walking with purses uh. and duffel bags the dad gets up from his seat to go look out the window he's walking around they're all walking around fine so i almost almost went up to them and said Hey, thanks for the extra time in line. I see you can walk just fine. Must be some sort of medical miracle. Yeah. But luckily, I didn't say a word. We get on the plane, and there's a tap, tap, tap on my shoulder. It's the one of the girls, the daughters of the wheelchair-bound parents who were not in wheelchairs, and she hands me this note that Ravi will read. Exhibit D. Deep breaths. It'll be okay. With a smiley face. Fans from the Row 20. So she was a Woody Show fan. Oh, I, I almost yeah. said something like, wow, your parents are totally fine. You frauds or something like that. Oh, yeah. But I didn't yeah. say a word. Thank God. So I I well, thank you for the kind, she, sweet note she that I She could be nice. Her that parents are dicks. Her, that's well, true. That's why yeah. I'm off board with the Southwest boarding because people are doing this all the time. To, it. Yeah, it to sucks. get on the flight first. Right. So yeah, that was that it. Recently. Deep breaths. It'll be okay. <laughs> and this is the one who I almost went up to and said, wow, your family sucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, uh, so there you go. There's uh, Greg's uh, Tuesday takeover, everybody.